Like in the I was just gonna say that. <laughs> I could have bobbed my head. I'm good at it though. Let's bump our heads together. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Good, good morning. morning. Rock here. Nancy here. That's uh, tough on the neck. Yeah, like we're like the frame is so narrow that frame it's is like tight. it's tight. We we can't. We want to make 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 sure you guys see us dance, and it's important. Right. Well, we can't go full out and, and do a river dance or dance the macarena. I'm just happy you didn't go this way, and I went that way. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we can't stop. That's hilarious. How's everybody doing? Yes. How's everybody doing this Thursday morning? Cheers. Beautiful. Cheers. Oh my goodness. So we're drinking uh, Po. Dot co. T. Just say T. Just see. But I mean, some people are like... They want to know? Wow, what are they drinking this morning? And maybe that's what they're on the show for. They just want to know exactly what we... just want to see what we're drinking, yeah. Yeah, because it's always something weird. Oh, that's the first drink of the day right there. Woke uh, up a bit late this morning. Yeah, we um we slept in. Slept in. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I woke up at... I usually wake up at 5.30 to go do, like, well, we... Ditto. We, we wake up at 5.30, yeah. we do our morning routine. Yeah. Should tell this morning, I woke up at, well, the alarm went off at 5.30, and then I'm like, nah. Mm. Plus, I did one of these, a hug. Yeah, he reached his arm yeah, out, and I was her. like, no, I have to go for a run. And I'm like, oh, but those arms, they, they look so, like, open. <laughs> they were. So I went, I just, okay, quick hug, because I want to go for a run. And I woke up at 6.50. I give good hugs. That's a good hug. A long one. So much that I passed out. <laughs> we deserve it. You deserve it. Yeah. Big announcement. Drum roll. I'm such a better drum roll learner. I only got you. one hand. Yeah, I know, but... Yay! I'm done my... Officially done my OVO. And I'll talk to you about that in a moment. And my online course, it's all done. My huge Yay! projects. Let's just say I'm done my huge projects. Up on the air, launched it. It's out there. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. You did really well. Thank you. My goodness. You did it. So many hours. So many hours. So many um, pulling hair moments. Yeah. I mean, I'm not a tech person, so trying to learn how to do all yeah. kinds of things for our website and how to launch. An OVO is basically you have a an ad on Facebook, people click on it, it brings them to a different page, like on our website. It's ah. called an opt-in page. People give them their, give me um, their email, email. address. Yeah. And then once they do that, they, um, they go into their inbox and then they have to confirm the subscription. And then I did like an auto, uh, email Automation. automation yeah. uh, autoresponder that every three days they get an email from me because I created a three-part video series of For free. the best practices of reducing your stress and enhancing your health and wellness yep. and then the day after that they get a sales video yep. um, introducing you guys to uh, my online course which is reduce your stress it's after reduce three videos your though. yeah so you get a bunch of like value value a bunch of content on how to reduce your stress yep. and enhance your health and your and wellness if you want to take it to the next level well, yeah there's a course for that there's a course for that I mean, it's awesome. Yeah, super it's is. It's awesome. So last night we, um, well, it was, we by the time we figured everything mom. out, it was five. And I said, oh, let's just go to the beach and enjoy. Like, you remember when you were kids, you used to go to the beach, like, and it was like that, you know, the time of day, the lighting is just like more orange and it's just like beautiful. Right after supper, close to supper. Yeah, right? and you spend the evening and I really wanted to watch a sunset and we had like a, a big debate going to the beach about like the half, half full, half, half full. The half, half full. The cup half full, the cup half empty. I mean, eventually, so, eventually you won the uh, debate. But so what, yesterday was, was the cup what? Well, it was half and half. I'm going to give him that. You want to know why? Just because. And so it was half a full and half empty? <laughs> yes, but okay. I guess it's because when we went to the beach, it was like partially cloudy, mostly cloudy. Yeah, there's the word. Mostly cloudy. And mostly. then the sun was like peaking. But bit. it was, when we got to the beach, it was actually nice and sunny the whole time, except for around eight o'clock. Because I wanted to stay till sunset. 
I thought it would have been a really nice magical celebra celebration mm -hmm. moment. Yeah, I was. But then eight o'clock rolls around and the storm clouds come in and then. It was closer than that. Yeah, it was. I almost had it. Like, maybe it'll clear I up. Almost maybe had it'll it. clear up. But my optimism, <laughs> Wait, no, it's not. my optimism, I put it out there and it was sunny for most of the time, nice and hot, and we went in uh, water. We had a great time. We had a great time. We had a great time. I, I enjoyed it a lot. I know. All my, that to minus say the that. sand fleas, but you know, I'm still alive. It's okay. Do you have any bites? No, because I was adamant and watching. I know. I just crushed them. Yeah. What's your favorite part of the beach? You got me off, on, off uh, on the... I mean, besides seeing me, of course. Oh, well, that's what I was going to say, but I didn't want to, you know. My favorite part of the beach, I'll tell you what it is. It's, uh, well, it's not my favorite part of the beach, but it's one of my favorite things to do. It's just to watch people. You're a people watcher? Yeah, just to see what they do. I like watching people, how they react, because it, it's... When you're at the beach, in general, most people are, they're free, you know. No shirts, very Vacation little, mode. very little clothes, and they're having some drinks, and they're just chilling out. They're throwing, they're playing, and they're throwing a they're, frisbee. Yeah, they're and free spirit. I, I just I like watching it. people in that kind of element. It's uh, it fuels me up. It, it gives does. me some fuel. Yeah, it's it's a, it's an amazing vibe. It's yeah. like, like I want to become beach bums. Well, it's not like I just sit summer. there and watch people the whole time. <laughs> hey, hey, did you see that person? No. Watch for a bit, and then I do what they... You glance. You're yeah. a glance person. Yeah. I wouldn't say, like, watch, per like, I don't know. Well, I'm, it kind of sounds weird, because I said people with no clothes, and I'm saying I'm watching them. It's like, ah, oh, <laughs> that's not what I meant to say. <laughs> yeah. But yes, when you're at yeah, the beach, you're in your bathing suit, and you're, you're having a good time. You're getting your tan on. Yeah, yeah. I like the vibe, especially at that beach, because... Uh, a lot, there's uh, like a lot of variety. People are working out. There's like people on like TRX bands. Other yeah, people, they're like, people strapping like them. they're playing volleyball. They're playing badminton. People are bringing barbecues and they have like, it's super cool. It's awesome. Super it's cool. like the vibe is awesome. I feel yeah. like I'm on a resort somewhere. I want to get a barbecue now. Yeah, I know. Just like a portable thing and you go charcoal. and spend the, I have a feeling we're going to spend a lot of time at the, at, I love at that the beach. beach this summer. Yeah. yeah. And I discovered it when I went biking like last week it was yeah. like oh my god this feels like i feel like i'm out of town like i feel like i'm in it's like incredible. i don't know california or something because of the nice homes along the beach the yeah. waterfront yeah. and then you have like the the harbor like with all of the the boats the boats, sailboats sailboats so yeah anyway it was awesome awesome celebration it was fantastic yeah you deserved it plus i went live yesterday as well with my life coaching stuff <gasps> so yes 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 oh wait i am now you want to hear a good drum roll? So you put your fingers like this? Okay. Mm, See? No. No? All right. That's Whatever. Fair. Who's got the best drum roll? Say it. Come on. Um, yeah, so perseverance. You persevered. You did really well. I'm really happy that your stuff is online. I'm really happy that my stuff is online. Now, my next goal is to build a course as well. Mm-hmm. And what then... What are your next, services? In case people don't know. My services, oh, for like life coaching? Mm -hmm. Well, it's the one-on-one, -on -one, you know? If you, you want to achieve some goals, I'm here to help you push you in that direction. And uh, I'm a no-nonsense kind of guy, you know? I'm a life coach. I'm not a therapist, so... Uh, make sure you attain your goals. And make sure you attain your goals. You push through all that stuff. That's what I want to do. I want to help people strive towards their own version of... Uh, or own vision of greatness. And I have the enough compassion and empathy but also mixed with a military kind of attitude to get people moving yeah <clears throat> people need that i mean i am not uh, i don't like to beat around the bush i'm i wouldn't say blunt but i'm certainly direct to the point you're a no nonsense kind no of guy. nonsense kind of guy but, and i think you'll learn but you're like i feel you i feel like I what you're going through you. i mean you have the barriers i hate it but let's let's yeah. push through it and let's get your, your yeah. goals that you want yeah. so you can live your best life <laughs> so that, yeah. I'm proud of you too. I'm proud of myself. It's live. I wanna. I'm doing this. You're doing this, man. I'm doing this. You've been wanting to do this for a while. Yeah. Actually, you were a life coach before I was a health coach. I sure was. Yeah. 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 But you did a lot of life coaching with your career. I like did. As a social worker. I so. did. Well, I wasn't a social well, worker, I mean, but like... employment counselor. But here's the thing about when you work in the employment sector, you often have to counsel people. And even if it's not mandated as part of your job, you have to because people repeat the same mistakes over and over and then lose jobs, lose jobs, lose, lose jobs, lose confidence, lose confidence. And then you're like, 
you're not going to get a job in this state. I mean, you might, but you're going to end up repeating the same pattern. Yeah. So we got to talk about that. Why are you doing that? Right. Change your approach for sure. And then you end up like just counseling them for weeks while they job search. It's, well, that's uh, why they would want to go back to you because you yeah. help them out a lot. Yeah, I changed. I helped. A, well, I didn't change anybody, but I helped encourage people to change themselves. And uh, sometimes you need somebody to say to you, hey, I think you could be doing this instead, instead of doing what you're doing now. Mm hmm. And that's all it is. That's all it is, basically. Yeah, it's, so it's, I'm excited. Yeah, like a, a different way of looking at things because when 100%. people are like doing the same things over and over again, it's just that's just the way they see things. But if you give them a different uh, point of view, yeah. you know, it can kind of help them see a little bit clearer. So yeah. exactly, exactly. It's just to support people while they progress to, towards their own greatness and uh, make sure to. Let them know that, you know, hey man, your goal is attainable and uh, you deserve to uh, and are worthy of pushing yourself towards this goal. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's not going to be um, easy, it's simple, but it's not going to be easy. And let's just push through and persevere through. Yeah. And I think I'm there to cheer you on. Exactly. And then with the tools that you're going to give them, they're going to yeah. be able to get that confidence that they need. Because they've never tried it that way before. Mm -hmm. So they're going to, you know, you giving them the tools, <clears throat> give them the confidence, and then they try it. That gives them yeah. the competence, and then it fuels their confidence. And yeah. Then, yeah. It's a cycle. It's a loop. Yeah. Confidence, competence, loop. That's right. So, yeah. So we want to wish you guys an amazing day. day. It's sunny Super out. Happy day. Enjoy yourselves. <laughs> it's funny because uh, I went back to work this week for three days, and I'm on holidays for the next three weeks after today. Yeah. <laughs> My clients are like, I'm going to see, I want to I reschedule with you next week. I'm like, I'm sorry, but I'm going on vacation. On vacation? I'm like, yeah, I know. Like the initial vacation that I had planned originally, it's they're one. starting next week. I mean, this quarantine, I mean, it's it's kind of funny, but it's... It is what it is. It is what it is. And We're happy. I am, I am, um, I'm happy. I'm going to play this song. You are? Yeah. Okay, well, that's a good, since you said happy, yeah, yeah. put it on. We love you guys. We love you very much. Thanks for tuning in. We yes. appreciate that. If you feel somebody would benefit from the message or our services, check out our website, yourjourneytowardswellness.com. Yeah, check out my... Uh, we are ramping up. My uh, opt-in page. Yeah, check it out. All right, have yourselves a great day. We love you. Bye, guys. Bye-bye.